Fox Puff, let's get after it. Yep. Oh my gosh. All right. Wick amount of platform pressure coming out from Two Saint. But Chillin already on the Shine Tech Chase, looking for those Shine grabs, but Puff on the knockdown, Tech's away immediately. Great defensive off from Two Saint. Waits for the roll in and gets a lot of damage off that up throw back there. God, it's so nice to watch how patient he is. Like <laughs> coming in with both lasers, but um, you know, being having a strong approach, but also waiting. And Two Saint finding that quick backer to seal out that first time. Forty-two percent. Nothing to scoff at though. That's a couple of neutral interactions mm -hmm. and then a dead puff. Mm -hmm. Chilin can definitely bring this back very quickly. Well, if he can lure him up to the top platform, <laughs> then yeah, he can take him out of one neutral interaction. Yep. Yep. But I think he knows better than that. Great job, pressure, oh. and nice SDS yeah. straight up into the air from Two Saint. And Tron nice. back there, a little bit of suspect DI, not full in and a wet, fall in and up. So even stock count, a little bit of a percent deficit from Chillin' Dude. Nice. Shine back are coming in, going back to stage. And Two Saint goes out, but misses his jump from ledge, instead gets that tournament winner, cannot punish immediately. Yeah, I'm surprised uh, at the lack of edge card there, but let's see how they do in neutral. Oh wow, pixel perfect percent on 75 on FOB. Even with good DI from Two Saint, goes right off the top. He's playing a little more patient now, a little more defensive after that. Oh, it's on the top flat. <laughs> Fox McCloud using this great maneuverability. Can't Two Saints getting caught rolling around on the. Uh, right corner of the stage. Right, but he's, chillin', dude. he's throwing out those hitboxes, and that's really what's gonna. <laughs> that's what was preventing Chillin from oh, approaching. Oh wow! I cannot believe that kill. Yeah. The eye was thought for sure that Two Saint was living that. He sneaks right back on nice. the ledge, shakes it out, shakes his arm, shakes out his arms. Maybe he got a little bit of a cramp in his hand. Who knows? That stretch, kids. Remember. These are long tournament days. Yep. Your hands won't last forever. No, they don't. Job reset, no. Goes over the flyover drill, tries to get a poke. Nice. Chillin's defensive game is looking so strong right now. Oh, yeah. Two Saint can't get anything strung together. Goes for the short and, and oh. Two Saint oh. seals it away. Uh, Not he, without a lot of hard work, though. Chillin dude still playing this matchup incredibly well, but Puff, the comeback king, crown sitting on her head. <laughs> See what she can do. Maybe an up throw rest, maybe a rest setup, or a nice little wall of pain. But chillin' dude, yes, this is right at the juicy kill percent for up throw, up air, or up smash. I think two saints staying out on the um, off stage is a good plan because his recovery options are so much more <laughs> than than Fox, and that's where he's gotten his the kills so far in this game. Nice little ledge just coming off from two saints, finding his way back to center stage. Can't find a searching up till chillin'. Oh, scary tech chase situation. Oof. Nice. Really reaching these dash tracks. Like maybe Chillin will catch on to it if he throws out one more. And the falling wow. up air. That's the old school Chillin dude special right there, ladies yep. and gentlemen. That was nice. Have Small you seen Two Saint play before? Two Saint is a... Uh, yes, I have. We, uh, I watched his uh, run at Summit. Uh, very aggressive, very creative puff. Definitely not your orthodox, like, H-Box, Michael style. He definitely likes to throw in a monkey wrench here and there. And yep. he's looking a little bit uncomfortable right now. I'm not going to lie to you. I actually watched, uh, he had a net play session with uh, the Shizwiz this past week. And those two very creative players with their characters in their own right. Um, definitely threw out a lot of stuff for the fans to uh, marvel at. So hopefully Toussaint will find his stride and maybe he can make this a competitive set. Right. I was interested last, whole last match, not a single rest attempt. So, you know. That says a lot about his confidence about his aerials, but also maybe he has that up his sleeve. Not sure. On the platform tech chase. Oh, tries to read that tech in. Can't quite get it. Great fall with that backer on the tech. Oh, oh wow. Chilling, popping off with that up with that up smash. I can't believe he got that in. I love it when Fox players hit that jump cancel up smash. Now he's gonna kill Nick. Mm. Mm -hmm. Throw their shoulders into it. Chilling definitely hyping himself up, having a great first game and getting to a second. People would think Two Saint would be the favorite to win this set. He's definitely been on a war path mm -hmm. on his up and coming run this past year. And Chillin kind of got a little bit of flack for being a little bit washed. That's kind of the, the consensus from a lot of the community now. But Chillin obviously showing he's here to play. Yup. 
I mean, and this guy's been on commentary all day. Uh, there's a lot of brain power that goes into that. Whether or not, <laughs> <laughs> not to not to <laughs> not to talk ourselves up, but you know, he's had a long day. Big brain commentators <laughs> is what I'm hearing. <laughs> it, it is a different headspace to go from playing oh, to absolutely. commentating. Yeah, you're looking for different things. It's definitely a difficult transition to make, but it looks like you might have gotten some warm up here with some top level puff talent. Mm -hmm. You know, Hbox himself being on Team Liquid, maybe. Like, Hey teammates! Hey teammate, you wanna get some warm up <laughs> in? Uh, I gotta gotta fight two saying, huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> nice. Nice. Wait for it, and that's yes. it. That patience. Chilling dude, eight to nine. More like chilling dude. Gonna win this set. <laughs> up three stocks to one. <laughs> oh, that was <gasps> a reaching. There, rest. Yeah, that two was. Saint, I don't blame Tuesday for going for the for going for the rest, but because he needs to make this comeback and he needed that zero percent rest, yes. but getting that thirty percent honestly wasn't worth it because he's nope. almost out of rest percent. Mm -hmm. He needed to have a guaranteed rest there if yeah. he's gonna go for it. And it's already too late. <laughs> like that is a juicy up there up there if I've ever seen one at that percent. Oh my gosh, Hillen looking so strong, looking like he's gonna make a run in this turn in this bracket. Oh. Well, hey, this isn't Cruz, so you know what? If he's still two socks up, that could still be a win, and it doesn't matter, right? It doesn't like, matter. We just need that victory screen. Right. Doesn't matter. If That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Fresh 2-0 for Chillin' Dude. <sighs> All right, well, Two Saint. Two Saint down is... Down into losers. Visibly upset. Yeah, I don't blame him. And he will be facing the winner of... Uh, Astro and Anvil. Astro and Anvil. I do not know either of those players, so... So maybe he has a chance. Oh, my boy, my boy Kezup's down there in Northeast Ohio. Uh, ice climbers and losers of this pool. Shout out to him. Yep. Oh, speaking of puffs, we've got H-Box in this pool. We have my own Cincinnati native Cal fighting it, facing off against sharks. But okay. Listen, it's a hot pool. It's I'm a, a Chicago pool. gal, and I was really sad when Kells lost to Morse code. But, uh, yeah, that was sad um, because Kel doesn't go to the majors no, except, like, the big house. So yeah. <laughs> this is, like, his... Kelly is um, a man who sits on his throne and is content to stay there. I mean, Kelly Smith can make a living winning weeklies at Melee, and that's he's still really good. So. He's, he's out here farming.